there is a desperate search for nearly 1,000 people feared dead after a ship packed with migrants capsized in the Mediterranean Sea. It is the latest in a string of deadly migrant boat sinkings. Video from this other sinking near Greece shows people panicking, swimming for their lives, all just hoping for a better life in Europe. Today, European leaders are planning an emergency summit to confront this issue. ABC's Alex Marquardt joins us from southern Italy now, where about two dozen survivors have been brought ashore so far. Alex, good morning. Good morning, Amy. Hopes are fading here this morning for those hundreds of migrants still missing, meaning this could end up being one of the deadliest disasters ever recorded in the Mediterranean Sea. Italy is now leading a large search and rescue operation, but so far just 28 migrants have been rescued from that small boat that capsized off the coast of Libya. Two dozen bodies have been recovered, but one survivor saying there could have been as many as 950 people on board. This is the latest tragedy in what Italy's prime minister has called a systematic slaughter in the Mediterranean. Just this year, 35,000 migrants have crossed from Africa to Europe with around 1,600 or more drowning in the process. And with now the weather getting better, it's feared those numbers will only get bigger.